I'm Kate from the Small Things blog. I normally have shorter hair, but I've added my very miscolored extensions in today. Um, I bought these when I got married because I was going to put them in my hair, but I decided to wear the hair that got me there, if you will, and not wear these extensions. But I was super blonde back then. Um, so they don't match, but I don't wear them out, so I haven't bothered coloring them. Today we're going to fishtail, um, and I'm going to do kind of a side fishtail so we're going to start just by gathering your hair into a side ponytail. So you just really need it to kind of hold everything to the side. So my fishtail might have some awkward pieces sticking out, partially because it just looks like I have a terribly layered haircut because of my extensions. But I'm going to basically so show you the concept. What you do is divide your hair in half and get that more even. Okay, so we've got two instead of three like a normal braid. And you pull one hair from the far section, bring it to the middle, and basically what it's going to do is join that side. And then on the other side, you're going to do the same thing. You're going to go over and join it in with that side. So it's a similar, a very, very similar concept to braiding except you're just using two strands and you're still going to the center if you want a really really tight fishtail braid take small sections if you want kind of a bigger softer braid just take smaller or larger sections Okay. You can kind of see it coming together there. It's difficult to run out of hair when you're fishtailing because you just keep adding hair from the other side to the other side. So all you just do is once you get in the rhythm is just keep going. Yours will be much more polished since you won't have to, to deal with two wildly varying lengths. You can kind of see that I'm raking through each section with my fingers just to keep it clean. So we'll go a few more. Okay, we'll finish up right about here. Grab another clear rubber band and put that right around the base of the braid or the fishtail. Okay, and then mine's already kind of coming looser because of the varying lengths of my hair, but if you wanted to kind of make it a little bit wider, all you would do is kind of gently separate it. So there you have it. That's how to fishtail. It's a very simple concept, but don't be frustrated if you can't get it the first time. Once you can understand how the sections just go to the other section over and over and over, it'll make more sense and I'm sure you'll be able to do it.